Hey guys, uh, sorry, I, I just can't stop laughing right now, but Star Wars, I'm on the Star Wars page, I heard about this from an amazing YouTuber, Star Wars Theory, you should go check him out, but, uh, I heard about this, uh, Disney Plus, uh, on October 1st, a new Star Wars Halloween special is coming out, uh, Lego Star Wars, uh, and it's set after Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker! Woo! Yeah! Um, honestly, I'm glad that they're moving away from the sequels. Like, that was my biggest problem. Like, okay, here's my thing. If they want to give, like, more spotlight to the sequel characters, do that, except for Rey. You can't fix Rey. You fucked her up. She's just a Mary Sue. But if you want to give Finn or Poe some development, that's good. Because they had potential, but you, they, you didn't focus on them at all during the sequel trilogy. And, like, this, the sequel trilogy was just so bad overall. Uh, so, I'm, uh, I'm glad that they're moving away from it and going post-Rise of Skywalker. Um... So, but basically, um, I, 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 uh, you should go check out Star Wars Theories video where he reads through this. But I'm just going to point out things that are interesting. Um, so yeah, it's with Poe Dameron and BB-8. Hopefully there's no Rey. Uh, that'd be nice. Um, but where where is it? Uh, Vinay shares three creepy stories linked to ancient artifacts and iconic villains from across all eras of Star Wars. That is an interesting concept, I will say. But, as Vinay spins his tales and lures our heroes deeper into the shadowy underbelly of the castle. Oh yeah, Vader's castle is, uh, where this will be taking place. So that's interesting in itself, too. But, um... They have to, uh, with the help of Dean, Poe, and BB-8 will have to face their fears and stop an agent evil from rising and escape to make it back to their friends. Now, uh, uh this is the reason why I'm laughing is, what if it's Palpatine, an agent evil from rising? If you look here, like, is it Palpatine? I really hope not, because... That was, for me, by far the worst thing, aside from Rey Skywalker at the end of the movie. The worst thing in Rise of Skywalker was Palpatine. Why would you bring him back? He he was done. Like, th that's just my point of view. Like, he died in Episode 6, and then br bringing him back, I don't care if it was a clone or whatever the fuck it was... It ruins the original trilogy, and it ruins, uh, what all the, like, all the original characters, Luke, Han, Leia, uh, they, they worked, they worked so hard to defeat the Emperor and Vader, and now, and, and Episode Nine just basically got rid of all of that. So, that's what I wasn't a fan of, so it's just funny that, <laughs> what if they bring back Emperor Palpatine for, like, the second time? <laughs> Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know why I made this video. I just wanted to shit on the sequels, because, uh, you know, they're garbage. And uh, take it from me, I didn't grow up with the originals, and I was born just when the prequels ended. And, though, and I would rather watch those six movies any day, and I mean any day, over the sequels. The sequels are garbage, and any of the good ideas that they had, they, they just threw them out of the window. So, yeah, uh, I guess this just turned into a sequel rant, but yeah, October 1st, new holiday special! Woo!